revenge, and then I yeah. get two hits and you're dead. So it's kind of awkward um, for Snake. But obviously, both of these players are very experienced in this matchup. So um, they know the ins and outs better than I do. Let's just say that. So we're getting started on PS2. Good old reliable, you know? If I go anywhere else on game one. Also, we were hauling out that grenade pull inside me. Yeah, I mean, that's what you gotta do. As as 6am, 6 6am's 6 full um, percentage is going to come from one opening and then it taking advantage of that into a lot of different um, second openings. And uh, like, it's going to be a slog to get neutral openings, but once he does, he's like, it's corner pressure and his disadvantage is so quickly. Yeah. That's the corner pressure from one side to the other. Yep. <laughs> he ledge guard. He ledge trapped him on three different ledges there. He ledge trapped him on the right, then on the left, then back on the right. It was very funny. I'm curious to see how well he can sort of run with this lead. It's one of the things is like snake kills you so easily when you're approaching snake. But when you're not approaching snake, it's like a lot of times it's a few grenades here and there, and you can just hang on for a while. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, Pogo is not the type of player to like. Like when he goes down, like really like, get nervous and try to like force options, so continue to play his game yep. plan. So definitely not going to be worried about him coming back in here. But I mean, the way six is playing, it's it's looking tough for him to make a comeback. Right now, but that Nikita is going. Yeah, to I think he's so good there. If he send lead here though. Oh, good old reliable C4 and platform, yeah. baby. It looked like he might have tried to revenge, but didn't quite get it off. Yeah, he got he got a revenge on that grenade though. Yeah, and so got the this stack. is scary here. Yeah. Oh my god, Pogo is oh, he, yep. he was waiting. He was waiting for the perfect opportunity to strike, but Pogo was wa waiting for that perfect opportunity <laughs> to dash back. I, I love them just both dancing around saying, I, I, "I know this side is coming." Oh, and that C4 on the platform again. Gonna take the stock. Mm -hmm. Yeah, C4 on the platform coming huge for Pogo in that second second. He takes his first lead of the game. Mm -hmm. This is a best of three, by the way. So every stock is super near in here. Oh, yeah, yeah, that move is pretty strong. I do, sure is. I do love how like pretty stereotypically like in Sinor's matchups come down to oh just like don't get hit by side beat. Yeah, <laughs> you know, and it's just funny that we're seeing that like come into play. <laughs> like, like this does not usually play this one dimensional, mm -hmm. but I think it just works versus Snake. Yeah, you know? <laughs> that was that was so. I love that. I love that up smash. I thought jab jab grab was really good. So this is a really dangerous position for 6am because all he knows all he needs is one side B or like one really big option. But Pelka knows that too, so he's got to be very wary not to get baited out by it. And then the floor there, not tight enough. Yeah, not gonna do it, but 150. There are not a lot of moves on Incineroar's game. Do not kill. Yeah, one forward tilt, one dash attack. That one would have done it. <laughs> he had the right read. Oh, but that also. Yeah, 6 a.m. had the right read there at the end there, trying to uh, catch uh, Pelka's landing. She didn't quite get it there, and then Pelka taking advantage of that, winning the next neutral interaction, and then getting an up uh, tilt in the corner to take game one. That is uh, not looking good for Connecticut's boy, but this is this is 6 a.m.'s music counter pick now. Of course. Okay. So... You know, fun fact, I, I drove up with 6AM. Um, he has a lot of Sonic on his playlist, on his, on his car playlist. So. Surprised he didn't pick Sonic, uh, Sonic music here, but, you know. Who, who's to say? <laughs> All right, game two. I think we went back to PS2, so yeah. no changes there. Just gotta, just gotta win that last neutral interaction, basically. Yeah. Right? That's what it. That's what it came down to. He knew he had the right read. He's got to continue trusting his game plan because it was a good game plan at the end of the day. But maybe if he can just get one or two more, you know, good reads in neutral, he can get a bit of bigger lead and it doesn't come so close. With that missed tech and only gets the downer off it. Just curious what the tech chase was. Yeah. Yeah, this is strange. This is one of the matchups where he either isn't that good. That would be real trade with it. But the C4 coming in clutch. C4 on the platform again, yeah. And I think some... Not the best CI on it as well. I think he just wasn't ready for it at all. Yeah, I mean, it happens. 
Yep. I think if you get hit by C4, you're you're normally not ready for it. It's gonna be yeah. hard either. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just packing on the percent. Yeah. Way. So many grenades. So much. What? What? Hello? Can can Sakurai come and chat and explain that to me? Malika just like slid across. Just like, ah, it's fine. It's like a grenade cool. flew up and it like clanked with the hitbox of, of side B. I think it might have been like additive knockback with sending it back, but yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, not quite able to close that out off that down tilt and so much percent. Our pub is up so much. I'm worried about 6 a.m. here. Like, you just gotta stay mentally yeah. in this. Like, it's or not quite with the up on the side B. It is hard, especially. Um, Oh my god, the grenades coming in so close to these side dudes, by the way. They were not they were not there in game one. Yeah. The way they are in game two. Really good. Oh my god, is that it? Dang. And that across the stage. Six AM's on the board here. Yes. Across the stage at 180 if that didn't KO, I would have been very surprised. <laughs> But this is Incineroar the character. He, he can gain a little bit of momentum here. Put, shake a little fear in Felga. It'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, it's already got him to 52. Get one revenge in here, and this is basically kill percent already. Yeah, as long as you get him down to last <laughs> stock, you have a chance, but Felga is not yep. going to allow that. Felga and finding that grab. And he wins it. 2-0. Two, two oh. Yep. Are they, um... And yeah, 6 a.m. is headed, headed into the loser's bracket. Unfortunate, but you know. It is what it is. You feel me?